pals, this for revenge. A solution of hydrogen peroxide and one of saturated potassium iodide. What's this? Mountain Dew. <laughs> refreshing. Now, we're going to combine these chemicals with ordinary dish soap, creating a little exothermic release of oxygen. <laughs> oh. <laughs> For me, vengeance. Yes, exactly. This is brilliant, Sheldon. How are we going to deploy it in Kripke's office? Already taken care of. Observe. This is a live shot of Kripke's lab via a mini webcam I was able to install thanks to a dollar bill discreetly placed in the night janitor's shirt pocket. <laughs> At the same time, I also secured large quantities of these chemicals above the tiles in the drop ceiling. Uh, Sheldon, you remind me of a young Lex Luthor. <laughs> You flatter me, sir. Let me guess, motion sensors? Yes. The reaction will be triggered when Kripke reaches the center of the room. Mwahaha. I gotta say, I am really impressed. This is truly the Sheldon Cooper way to get even. <laughs> It may be low tech, but I still maintain the whoopee cushion has comic validity. <laughs> Here comes Kripke. Who is that with him? I believe that's the president of the university. And the board of directors. Abort! Abort! There is no abort. Well, how could you not put in an abort? I made a boo-boo, all right? I think the board will really appreciate how well we're using that NSA grant, President Siba. Right here we have a micro-controlled plasma... <laughs> It's like the Ganges on laundry day. <laughs> At least they don't know it was you. Hello, Kripke. <laughs> this classic prank comes to you from the malevolent mind of Sheldon Cooper. <laughs> if you'd like to see the look on your stupid face, this video is being instantly uploaded to YouTube. Oh, and a hat tip to Leonard Hofstadter and Raj Kuthrapali for their support and encouragement in this enterprise. Well, I'm going back to India. What's your plan? 